Well, hey there, folks. This is Wade Rush, host of the BRO channel. Got a hot news update for you for um, upcoming 2019 deer season here in South Carolina. There have been legislative changes that we just found out about this weekend. Let me see if this made me look real sophisticated here. Rachel got her tag package in the uh, in the mail Saturday. And my internet has been down all weekend, got hit by lightning and blew up the modem. Needless to say, we just got it fixed this morning. But there have been changes to the tagging system for this year, guys. Here it is as reads right here on Rachel's tags. It says, yes, your tags are different this year. A new law was passed that resulted in improvements to the antlerless deer tag program for South Carolina residents. Based on feedback from hunters, South Carolina DNR worked with the General Assembly to eliminate the eight-day specific antlerless tags and replaced them with two antlerless. Took away eight and gave us two antlerless deer tags that may be used on any day beginning September 15th in Game Zones 2, 3, and 4 and October 1st in Game Zone 1. This simplifies the tagging system and increases a resident hunter's opportunity and flexibility to take antlerless deer from eight days to 109 days. Again, took away eight, gave us two, but gave us all season to take those two. Harvest statistics show that 92% of South Carolina hunters only harvest two or fewer antlerless deer each season. They didn't ask me. That being the case, the new legislation will cover the needs of most hunters. For hunters who want um, additional opportunity to take antlerless deer, there is still the ability to purchase up to four antlerless deer tags for $5 each. That's been the case for years and years and years here, folks. Or to participate in the property-based deer quota program. There it is. I will try to blow it up. I hope my camera took a good enough picture of it so I can keep it up here where you guys can read it. If we can find anything on the DNR website, I have not been able to. I looked recently and it doesn't look like they have updated this information on the South Carolina DNR website. But here it is, right here on Rachel's tags that she got here over the weekend. This is very important and it'll be a very important change. Okay folks, we're not going to talk about our opinions on this stuff and all that right now. The only thing I will say is it's not a big surprise to me that this happened. We went from having no uh, limit on antlered bucks, no limit on antlered bucks to getting three per year. And so we went from having an opportunity to take eight antlerless deer to getting two. That's just the fact of the matter there. That's how it is here now. So anyway, whether you like this or not and all that folks, contact your legislators and just let them know and stuff like that. So anyway, this is Wade Rush, host of the BRO channel. This is how it is. This is upcoming season. It's just weeks away. Just weeks away here in South Carolina. Alrighty, folks. We'll be back with another one very, very soon. Bye-bye.